Hello everybody and welcome back, or welcome back I guess, I don't know, welcome to Mass Effect Legendary Edition, which I have been dying to get my little hands on for like a week now I guess, um, and I finally got it going. I am currently sitting in the living room of my sister and brother-in-law's apartment, so I can't be too terribly loud, um, but I will have put up an announcement video before this explaining why things kind of are the way they are, but here I am trying to record this. Um, if you weren't able to watch that video earlier, um, I'm living a nomad life essentially, which kind of summarizing it living a nomad life and I'm not gonna be able to play very regularly um, but I will play when I can and upload when I can and maybe put up pictures of where I'm currently staying <laughs> and what campgrounds I'm in and stuff um, but yeah I'm so excited I've been I'm been so excited to play this I haven't I have I haven't been keeping up too terribly much on the news because I like I want to I wanted to be kind of surprised but I have been reading some things I am currently attempting to record this in 1080p uh, we'll see how long that lasts, but I'm trying to get the full effect of the new graphics, and I'm really freaking excited. Uh, let's do it. Let's just do it. I'm, I'm just ready. Oh, stupid mouse. I am, so one thing that I'm excited for that I double-checked is that you can now use a controller on the PC. I'm playing this on my monster uh, PC that I have, my relatively new one. And I haven't played this in like a year and a half yet, Mass Effect, and I'm like, ready? Oh, are we gonna, are we gonna freak out? Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm sorry. Of course this is scuffed right at the beginning. Listen to that music! <gasps> okay, okay, oh my gosh, this is so weird. I haven't, like, played, like, a brand new game in so long. Welcome to Alliance Military Database. It's been, like, save game pluses and Classified stuff. Classified information requested. Oh. Establishing secure connection. Oh my gosh. Secure connection confirmed. They've, they've changed it a little bit. Oh my gosh. Whoa, they look so shiny. Due to your covert, this is, I feel like I'm brand spanking new. New ID. Uh, custom Please email. Please log in to access your profile. Um, oops. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> I almost forgot what her name is because I've had a couple. But Raven. So, oh, by the way, I am remaking my first Shepherd, who's a par I should maybe have said this. I'm going to be playing a Paragon. Um, I guess also this is a little late in the video to say, but I am not a brand new player to Mass Effect. If you've seen anything on the channel, I play a lot of Bioware games. And Mass Effect 3 was the first series I uploaded onto this channel. But I played the first two before that. Then I just had to start a YouTube channel for Mass Effect 3 and went from there. <laughs> anyway, um, so yeah, I am, I have played this before, but as always, I'm always, um, I don't know, le learning new things, you know? Please reconstruct profile. I don't, I don't know everything Confirm in the game. Confirm service history. I decided I was or, or, Earthborn. I was an orphan raised on the streets of the great metropolis that's covering Earth. You escaped the life of petty crime and underworld gangs by enlisting with the Alliance military when I turned 18. Confirm psychological. Profile. I was a war hero. Early in your military career, you find yourself facing an overwhelming enemy force. You risk your life to save your fellow soldiers and defeat the enemy despite impossible odds. Your bravery and heroism have earned you medals and recognition from the Alliance fleet. I need a drink. <laughs> Yeah, I was I was pretty I was pretty standard. I think not a lot of people choose Earthborn, but I uh, but War Hero I, I wanted to be a War Hero. Anyway, when I first played, uh, I was I remembered reading that Soldier was the best one to start as because it was um, you had like a variety of like weapons and stuff. And you didn't have to worry too much about the special abilities in um, Mass Effect Two and Three. My favorite is Vanguard. I really like punching people with my face. Um, a lot. I also actually really like Engineer, too. But I think I'll go with Vanguard this time. I don't know if I've actually... I think I have finished a Vanguard playthrough in Mass Confirm Effect 1. facial identity. No! <laughs> yes! Okay, here's the thing. Someone told me, um, that you can... 
they they told me about this today. I found out today that I got my Mass Effect 3 code. Um, like I looked it up because I have my YouTube videos, right? So I have my YouTube videos, looked up the Mass Effect 3 code from those, and, and now I can just enter that in. I will be messing around with things because I want to check out some of the new stuff, but I just kind of want to, I want to put this in and see how it looks like right out the gate, you know? <laughs> what? I don't know why. I must be putting something in wrong, and it also keeps adding a point one there at the end, which isn't isn't in the normal game. Um, let me. I need to. I need to fix her skin. Why is her skin? What? Why is everything pink? Is it because there's like a pink? It looks like there's like a pink line o over to the left. I don't even think, I don't know if her facial structure is even right. Like, this is, I'm a little worried. Uh, uh. <laughs> I'm just, this is this is gonna be this is something else. All right, I need to take off the, the makeup. No, stop. Oh my gosh, it's so sensitive. Uh, lip color, none. Take it off. Eyeshadow color, black. If she has any, it's black. And then. Her hair color is absolutely wrong. It was like a dark brown. How many options do we have now, though? Ooh! They finally gave us multiple colors. I knew that they were doing that, but it's fun to see. Is that black? Or dark brown. I don't know. I think it's probably black. Or not black. We're dark brown. Not Auburn. Maybe that one. Okay, and we get new hair. Which is fun. Oh boy, though. <laughs> what do these look like? Okay, that's actually a nice... That's, that's nice. That actually looks like my current haircut right now, kind of. Except my hair is much longer. Ooh, I like that. Ah, they finally give us some interesting hairs. Let's see, I'm not expecting anything incredible, but I think I'm just gonna have to stick with my ponytail. There we go. Brow colors should be fine. I think her face is probably, her, her face is probably right. Um, let's look at the makeup. Just because I want to see what they do. Oh, that's not bad. I usually try to go with like a nice dark eyeliner. That's a nice one. And like not much of anything. Ooh, that one like makes her look super green. Don't worry, I'm not going to do clown makeup. Um, where's that? This one was nice as compared to... They look kind of the same, except maybe one has... I don't know. That one's good. Also good. I can't tell the difference. Is it the little... No? I don't know. We'll do that one. You can't change your face in this one, though. I'm pretty sure. Unless they've changed that, too. I feel like, at least what I've learned way back with Bioware stuff, is that generally the darker, like, the nice, like, black, like, eyeshadow and eyeliner really helps make your eyes pop. Otherwise, you're kind of screwed. Uh, let's see. I 
think really we're 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 good. Anyway, here's Raven Shepherd. <laughs> she looks pretty much how she did, just slightly better, honestly. There's I I've got the picture up on my phone. And obviously they've even like they've made it look much nicer. But I think I can still her skin tone though is we like I, I think I had it maybe like a little it would be under hair. No. Oh, we did scar. That's right. Her skin might be a little light, but I think it's okay. It's just hard to tell with that pink light over on the left. I don't like it. We didn't get scars before, so I definitely want a scar now. That's gonna be cool. A cool little addition. On the eyebrow one, I've, I'm always a fan of the eyebrow one. I like this one, I think, actually. Honestly. <gasps> oh my gosh, did we do- Oh my gosh, she's beautiful. I'm so excited, actually. <laughs> like, seeing her in, like, such, like, high res. And I always remember- Oh, let's double check the eyes. The eye color. Um... I remember when I first played Mass Effect 1 for the very first time. I was flipping through the colors. And this green, like, I don't usually do green eyes. But this green popped out at me, like just like was so bright and I think they it's not as bright as it used to be um but it's still quite striking I think they even let you I think they were oh I'm a sucker for silver eyes and purple eyes but nope we're the green eyed raven see how like that's like a dark green and then a bright green it's pretty I don't know it was I thought it was very striking and I kind of picked the eye color and then everything else around that. Oh, she's so beautiful. I'm actually so excited. I, it, it turns out better. It turned out better than I thought it would, honestly. Profile reconstruction complete. She, she turned out much nicer than I thought she would. I, Cause I keep seeing pictures, people's pictures online and I'm like, oh, the Mass Effect 1 one is still a little bit janky, but no, at least in person. And of course I'm biased cause it's my character. So I'm like, of course she's beautiful. <laughs> Uh, I will be unable to change any settings. I like it. Identification confirmed. Let's actually do insanity, because I really enjoy pain. Uh, auto level up off. Legendary mode. Okay, the original one will be used instead of the new. Yes. I do want to try the legendary mode, but I may switch back and forth between legendary and classic. Um. Oh, but that that could weird that could be weird on the leveling scale, couldn't it? I wonder if you can't change that. I'll try legendary. I, I want to try out the new, like the new the, like the upgrades that they've done. You know, even though I personally really enjoy the leveling up that they did in um, the old game, I liked having sixty levels. <laughs> Subtitles on, auto save on, tutorials. Sure, why not? We'll just have them up for completion's sake. Oh my gosh, look at that Mass Effect relay. <gasps> you can see well, the reflection. What about Shepard? Earthborn, but no record of her family. Oh my gosh. Doesn't have one. She was raised on the street. Heck yeah. Learned to look out for herself. Yeah, she did. Look at the reflection. She proved herself during the Blitz. Held off enemy forces on the ground until reinforcements arrived. She's the only reason Elysium is still standing. Heck yeah. We can't question her courage. Look at the hair. It's so beautiful. Humanity needs a hero. And Shepard's the best we've got. I'll make the Oh, call. I'm smiling like an idiot. Oh my gosh, dang fool. We're explorers on Mars discover the remains of an ancient space spring civilization. There's new technologies. Oh my gosh, this music. Oh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I hope I'm being quiet enough. Oh my god, the simulations of the, of the galaxy, call it! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so gorgeous! Wow, the detail! I can already see the details! My ship! My true love! The Arcturus Prime relays in range, initiating transmission sequence. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh my, the cat's, the cat's like, why are you freaking out? Oh my gosh. We are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. Joker, oh my gosh, hi! <laughs> the relay is hot. Acquiring approach vector. All stations secure for transit. 
Oh you. my gosh, it's like coming home. Oh, there's my ship! Oh my gosh! Hitting the relay in three, two, one. This is actually insane. Like, it's so Thrusters, cool. Look at Joker! Look at him! Check. Internal emissions sync engaged. Hey, All there's my space online. husband. <laughs> Caden, not Joker. Joker's a good option, though. Fifteen hundred is <gasps> your captain will be. Oh close. my gosh! I hate that guy. Nihilus gave you a compliment. So oh my gosh! Oh my gonna be great. <laughs> Remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom. That's good. I just jumped the <gasps> way across the galaxy. I'm so gorgeous. The size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Oh my god! Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. You're paranoid. <laughs> the council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. Only an idiot believes the official uh, story. So maybe I should have said this before. I don't know if I have. Also, my controller stopped working. That's cool. Um, anyway, <laughs> um, I'm having some issues apparently with controller input. Uh, yes, I know. Okay, maybe I need to turn off the freaking tutor tutorials. Um, but the animations are like they're subtly different but like that like there's like there's like some things that are like emoting slightly and like look you can kind of see the wrinkle and the freckles are really cute and you can see the texture of her skin this is actually crazy also Caden looks really good he looks really good they don't send specters on shakedown oh my gosh look at my so face more going on here than the captain's letting up joker status report just cleared the mass relay captain stealth systems engaged Everything looks solid. Good. Find a calm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we meet you in the Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here. <laughs> Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the calm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? Oh my gosh. Also, I, don't, I, I was saying this earlier and I got distracted by how shiny everything is, but I am playing a Paragon run. This is my original Mass... Well, I guess I, but my very first time I played Mass Effect, I played a male Shepherd, and I got to Mass Effect 2, found Thane, and decided that he was the best thing that ever happened to me, so I went back <laughs> and I started playing a female Shepherd. So this is my first female Shepherd, and she's a Paragon. Um, so, yes, we're going to do Paragon stuff. He sounds angry. Something must have gone oh my, the mission. Oh my gosh! Captain always sounds like that when he's Their faces! Me. Can't possibly imagine why. Their faces are emoting! Like, in ways that I didn't think was possible! Okay, quick, we gotta turn off... Turn off tutorials. Also, I am definitely having issues with the controller input. Uh, what would I do it? Uh, yeah. Off. Okay. Yeah. Oh, come on. Huddle up. Nope. What? I think. Do you hear that? I think it's trying to like. It's acting like it's a D-pad. It's not the D-pad. The D-pad's over there. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Okay. So as per usual, it's a user error that messed it up, and I pressed. There was a button I pressed on my controller apparently that changed the set that switched it so that the D-pad and the left stick were mixed up. Anyway. We're uh, we're good now. We're good, and I know that if you click on these guys, they don't say anything. Yeah. The captain's waiting for you in the room. They won't let yeah. They won't let you. They won't let you chat chit chat. Oh my gosh, the map is gonna be amazing. He's probably already got like four. Congratulations, Commander. Looks like we had a smooth run. Look at you heading down to see the captain. How their mouths and jaws move different. Look at those prinkles. Uh. Sounds like you don't trust Arturian. Look at her face. Sorry, Commander. Just having a chat with Adams down in engineering. It didn't mean to cause any trouble. 
But you have to admit, something's odd about this mission. The whole crew feels it. You think the Alliance brass look at, is holding Look out at those there? eyebrows! All we're supposed to do is test out the stealth system. Why is Captain Anderson in charge? And then there's Nihilus. Spectres are elite operatives, top covert agents. Why send a Spectre, a Turian Spectre, on a shakedown? Shakedown run. It doesn't add up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you know about the stealth system? Look at my eyebrows! I just know it masks our location from scans and sensors, cutting edge technology. And Normandy's the only ship with this prototype drive. But why are we fully staffed? A skeleton crew would be cheap, less chance of security leaks, too. Plus, there's Nihilus. It's pretty obvious the shakedown run is just a cover. Oh, yeah, no, I'm doing all the dialogue options, baby. For what? Damned if I know, Commander. We're out here on false pretenses. I'm not a fan of being left in the dark. Yeah, but we're also soldiers, so we're supposed to say yes, sir, and run with it, you know? Do you have a problem with the captain? No, ma'am. But I can't figure out what he's doing here. Captain Anderson is one of the most decorated special forces officers in the service. If he melted down all his medals, he could make a life-size statue of That would be something. You don't send a soldier like that on a do-nothing mission. He's treating this shakedown run too seriously. Something big. We should all be, like, pleased that we're part of, like, some secret covert, covert, covert ops mission thing then, you know? But no, for real, it's like, it is, it's one thing to be like, I'm a soldier, and you'll do what you're told, but it's another thing to, like, have your own brain being like, hmm, this isn't quite right. <laughs> you don't trust Nihilus. I don't like Turians. <laughs> Racist! Runs in my family. My grandfather runs in my That's not how it works. I lost a lot of friends That's... when the Turians I mean, it, it's not like, it, it does work that way often, but it's a taught thing. It's a learned thing, not like, oh, it runs in the blood. Like, no, that's dumb. <laughs> Uh, it'll be interesting. This game was first made in 2007, and there are some things. They've changed a few things, like, uh, oh, if you're the ones crying about the Miranda butt shots being changed in Mass Effect 2, I hope you uh, just die crying. <laughs> you know, I hope it haunts you to your to your end of days on your dying deathbed. You're like, oh, the Miranda butt shots, because that's, that's just ridiculous. Anyway, they have changed some things for the better in a lot of ways. Um, but it'll be interesting, maybe, to see some things that pop up that you're like, oh, okay, <laughs> interesting. That was 30 years ago. You can't blame Nihilus for that. No, I guess not. But it still makes me nervous. No, I guess not. Board, especially a I just solved racism. We're an Alliance vessel, human military, but Nihilus doesn't answer to the captain like the rest of us. Spectres operate outside the normal chain of command. And they don't come along just to observe shakedown runs. <laughs> Nihilus looks like he's expecting some heavy action. I don't like it. Don't worry about it, guy. I'll see if I can get some answers when I see him. Good luck, Commander. Ooh, uh, look at that XP. So they've even changed like some of the graphics and stuff like that. It's great. Um, oh, dang. He couldn't take orders from a Spectre, but, you know, the Spectre doesn't have to take his orders. Oh, calm down, Jenkins. Calm down, Jenkins. Oh my gosh. Anyway, I am going to call this one here. Um, I just wanted to get at least a little bit of the video done, especially with a 1080p. It's going to be a massive video file. So I hope this recording works out. Thank you all so much. Again, I will try to upload and play this whenever I can. I'm bringing my laptop with me as I'm nomading around, so even if I can't come to my sister's and play there, I'll be able to maybe play on my laptop, but I can't make any promises. But thank you all so much for joining me. I appreciate it, and I hope to see you in the next one.